Hello everyone, welcome back to Clementine Creative. My name is Clementine and I'm back with you and with another video. Uh, I'm sorry that I wasn't back with a video on Friday. I actually went to my parents' house, so that kind of intertwined with my video uploading. Uh, but you're gonna have three videos uh, this week, at least three videos. Uh, all basically being about the weapons for Egyptia project. Now, uh, you did a, you did receive, the, I guess, the workers, as I named the, the video. Uh, I guess uh, you received that video very well. You didn't hate on the, on the video. You didn't uh, have any, you weren't offended. Uh, you didn't have any uh, inappropriate comments. And I think that's really nice. I'm really glad that everyone uh, was able to including myself, be more or less mature about the theme that I choose to display. Again, I want to thank you for being totally chill about that, and let's move on and let's talk a little bit about some some things. Um, these weapons that I'm now drawing are for the Egyptian project. These are for the play for the play bleh, getting my tongue twisted here. Uh, these are for the players, so players use these to fight enemies. Now, these weapons are not at all what you would basically have in Egypt. Uh, because in Egypt, uh, they only had their like clubs and like a sword, spears, not... But they're, they're very distinguished shapes, what they used. Um, they did not have katanas or, you know, great swords. These are the weapons that weren't even invented, you know, uh, uh, in, the, in the time of uh, Egypt. You know, uh, it was many years, many, many, many hundreds of years before that was even... You know, some of these weapons were even invented. Um, I guess not invented, you know... The axes and things like that been around for ages is, um, I guess, the shape of the weapons uh, weren't around forever. Uh, but of course, this is a fantasy world. This is not actually we're not trying to follow it 100%. So we are allowed to have some, uh, I guess, free spirit roaming. Um, I guess weapons wise. So all these weapons have a form or sort of a function. They're not just a, a sword. They're always something more. Instead of a, we have a claymore there. Sort of a claymore sword is the big one with the lion face as a handguard. That one, let's say, divides into two weapons. Then you can see the little snake spear here. It has the a, a giant blade inside. It's a spear or a small sword. Uh, so you know it has very. Diff it, they the weapons have transformations. I'm sorry, I'm getting the tongue twisters. It's crazy. Um, but yeah, all these weapons transform into something else. So you know. I wanted to create something a little bit more interesting. I was actually inspired by Bloodborne. Uh, in Bloodborne, you have trick weapons, which basically do the exact same thing as here, except uh, I try to, you know, do my versions of it. But uh, yeah, this is a pretty short video. It's a five minute video. I mean, we still have like two minutes of time, but I just wanted to ask you which videos do you like more? These, you know, five minute ones, or do you like, uh, you know, those 15 minute ones a little bit more? Uh, I really enjoy these five minute ones, they're very quick, although I do sometimes really want to do those 15 minute videos because, um, you know, things like painting, it's nice if it's a longer video because the video, if it's short, it gets really compressed, everything goes so fast, you can't really see anything. Uh, so tell me the next video is gonna be about painting these weapons and I'm gonna divide that into two separate videos. Tell me whether you wanted a long video or a short video. Uh, comment because these videos will be up in a period of like uh, one day break you know so one video one day nothing and then another video um, so yeah I would be uh, you know I'd really appreciate to see what you guys think and uh, yeah this is gonna be basically be it so um, <laughs> I'll see you in the next video uh, where I paint all of these weapons or not all of them uh, the ones that I chose and, uh, you know, we'll talk more about, you know, painting techniques and uh, how to texture. But yeah, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the process of creating weapons. This is something that we haven't done on this channel before. And I think it's a really nice and refreshing theme. Uh, but yeah, that'll be it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one. Bye.